Welcome to the number mysteries and the case of the uncrackable code. Ever since we've been communicating, we've been using codes. But it's during wartime that codes become really important. You don't want your enemy to know what you're going to do next. Now, one of the most sophisticated encoding machines is this one here. It's called the Enigma machine, and it was used by the Germans during the Second World War. They used it to keep their messages secret, and they thought this was uncrackable. But mathematicians sitting up in Bletchley Park, just north of here in London, and north of London, found a way to crack this code. Now, during this lecture, we're going to try and reenact this great feat of the mathematicians by challenging a team up at Bletchley Park to break the Enigma code. Now, earlier today, Evil Andy over here has locked away a load of sweets inside this safe, and he's locked it with a combination, and only Evil Andy knows the combination. Now, to make it even doubly secure, he used our Enigma machine to encode the numbers, and so it's become an even more scrambled mess. Now, I found this secret message that uh, he's encoded here, and, and we're getting it now sent up to Bletchley Park. This is Daniel Clapp, and he's sending it by Morse code to the mathematicians in Bletchley Park, and we're hoping they're going to be able to decode this message. So how are you doing, Daniel? Nearly done, Mark. Nearly done, okay. There we go. Okay, well, let's give Daniel a big round of applause for sending our secret message up. Great. All right. Now, the trouble is that I don't know quite how Andy set up this Enigma machine this morning when he encoded this message. And that's the challenge for the team in Bletchley Park to try and find how Andy encoded this, how was the machine set up when he wrote this message. Now, if the team at Bletchley Park managed to crack this code by the end of the lecture, all those sweets are yours, okay? But if they don't do it, then evil Andy walks off with all the sweets. Now, we've got a web link all the way up to Bletchley Park over here, and we're going to go and meet Tony Sale, um, who's one of the code crackers at Bletchley Park. Hi, Tony. Can you hear me? Hi, good evening. Great. Yes, now, uh, did you manage to get the secret message we sent up by Morse code? Yes, I did. I've got that, yes. Okay, so how on earth are you going to find the settings that Andy used on the Enigma machine? So we're going to use a reconstruction of the form machine, which is invented here for in World War II, which finds the settings for uh, the Enigma machine from the cipher message. And how long do you think it's going to take? Well, probably about half an hour. Half an hour, okay. It all work. Yeah. Okay, if it all works, well, I've got 400 kids here are hoping you're going to be able to crack this code. So we've got a hotline here, so please call us when you've cracked it, and uh, hopefully we'll make all these kids happy. So good luck. Yeah, good luck.